yes lads welcome back to yet again another video on the channel and today we've got another special video and another special play review on the man himself park g son obviously the man united legend korea legend um he's an absolute baller in real life and a baller in fifa as well i can't lie uh, but if you guys want to see me record these live come over to the twitch at lecky underscore lay it'll be on screen just above my head somewhere uh, come uh, check me out see what see what you get if you guys like the content or not uh, see some extra behind the scenes stuff some extra packs more gameplay all that, all that little stuff um but if you guys do enjoy the video please do like and subscribe but greatly appreciate it leave a comment for players you want to see in the next video um any players you want me to review next i'm going to do a player of the month messi um recording tomorrow on stream uh, so if you guys want to see that make sure you come check it out i've got like 70 safe packs for rule breakers team too Come check it out if you do enjoy it. Um, or uh, today, actually. It'll be today of this recording. By the time this video goes out, it'll be later tonight. But anyways, lads, I'm going to stop waffling. If you guys do enjoy the video, please do like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy the video, lads. Peace out. All right, lads. So this is Park G Sung's card. He's 5 foot 10. High, high work rate, which is very nice. Right footed. 3 star, 4 star, which isn't ideal. But if you're playing it, I'm going to be playing him at cam. So that's not going to be too important. I did buy him for 204,000 coins. Uh, from what I've heard, this card will be worth that money. Uh, but we're going to have to wait and see, obviously. Um, getting into his preferred positions, he can play right mid, left mid, and left wing, which is quite handy. Um, so if you play more like a defensive formation, maybe a three at the back, you get in your team no matter what, which is very nice. You got good, good secondary positions. His overall attributes, they're quite they're, they're quite overall well-balanced, which is just like what he was like in real life. 85 pace, solid. Shooting's not the best. Um, I will be playing him at cam, so I'm not going to try and be shooting from long range. I'm going to try and take it in with his feet. Um, 83 passing, vision's really nice, and his short passing is solid. Um, his dribbling stats overall are really good. Agility and balance, reactions, ball control, all really nice. Composure and dribbling's nice as well. Defending stats, defensive awareness is really nice. Interceptions is also alright for someone who's going to be playing cam. Uh, stamina is obviously one of the, the biggest parts and what he's known for. Um, and his aggression is very nice as well. Um, and going into his player traits, no player traits unfortunately, but overall it's a really nice looking card. Alright lads, so this is the team we're going to be using party Sun in. Uh, but we'll play a 4 one 2 one 2 in game which i'll show you guys right now and these are the custom tactics i'll be using for the few games we play moise can up front jesus right striker party on cam Vieira, bailey center mids kessie cdm and in the back four is obviously just the same and um, now this team isn't what i normally use this isn't my normal team this is just a few cards i have in my club that are a bit um sort of my, my substitutes or players that i just have in my club that i want to use and try out um, so that's what this team's made up of, of sort of players that I wouldn't normally use apart from like Vieira and all them sort of lot. Um, but a few players from my main team have made it into this team. But yeah, that's that's going to be the team for uh, the episode. That party on Cam. If he struggles to get involved in the game, I'll move, moving up. Uh, I'll move him up up front and he's loose into Cam and see how that goes. Uh, but yeah, let's get into the first game of the episode, lads. Hopefully, you guys do enjoy. All right, lads, going to the first game of the episode, playing Derby FC. What a guy? Um, Larissa Goal, Arujo, Veron. I didn't call you Baldy Baldy. Let's go up front. Let's go! Come on! Love that. Not, 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 not. It's quite a sweaty team. Not, nothing too, nothing too special in there. Fakir in midfield as well. But let's get straight into the game. Park G Sun debut. I'm on the boys. On Vieira. Park G Sun's through. Park G Sun one 0 Happy days, lads. Now I know you guys can see the the trainer. I did not mean to put that on, but Parchi Sun gets his first goal of the episode. Oh, I need to get the counter up as well. But that's not a bad start for Parchi Sun. Lads, I'm on the boys from Parchi Sun. Good ball from Moisey Keen. I need to remember he's only got three star skills. Parchi Sun, oh, unlucky lad. Not a bad effort though. Not a bad effort. Come on, lads. Let's let's mark up here. Shit! Don't you dare sweat it. Ah, fair enough, lad. I am playing absolutely dog shit. Oh shit, Sherlock! Come, nicely done. Jesus. Son. Park G Son. Good finish, lad. Park G Son with his second goal of the game. Beautiful. Bit of lucky to fall for him, but look look at the trim, lads. It's like he's got a melon on his head. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Come on, lad. Easy. Win that. Go on, Park G Son. Go on, son. Go on, mate. The, the absolute passion on him. Love that for you, son, by the way. Passion merchant. Oh, <laughs> good save. Please get up. <laughs> oh, no. Fuck off. I'm sorry, but like... Mate, how, mate Raheem Sterling, what, what's going on? How, how is he this good? Right, lads, that is half time done in the first game. Park Son did get two two goals, to be fair. Not a terrible half from him, uh, but my defence was pretty much non-existent. <laughs> Let's get into the second half. Oh, Tesco. No, no. Harry Kane, I swear to God, lads. No, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> 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 you shit. Twat. 
that. Look at you. Go back. Nicely done. Sun's there. Parchy sun. Oh, mate. That... Right, sound yet, cool. Let, let's get Parchy Sun on the corners, lads. Might as well. Let's take a corner with him. Just, just there. Just whip it in. Full power. Good ball. Go on. Oh my god. Mate, he's got some magical. I've, I never score headers off corners. That's mental. Parchy Sun with another assist. Go on, lad. Two goals and an assist. What a game. And again, off the corner, lad. Good ball. Unlucky. Give it back to Parchy Sun on the edge of the box. Yeah, that'll do. That's good enough. Parchy son! Ah, uh, unlucky. Doing a Ruho, man. You pleb. What a block. Kessie, please. Use that cock of yours. Be Thank you. Well, lads, that is the end of the first game of the episode. I have to say, Parchy son is absolutely... First impressions, he's absolutely class. He's really good. His dribbling's saucy. His passing felt slick. Obviously, he got two goals. Very nicely done. His corners were really good. Um, he was just good in general. He felt like a good card. His LB dribbling was slick. Really good card, and really, really, really enjoying using them. Uh, so let's get straight into the second game, lads. No hesitation, one the boys. Second game of the episode, Junction FC. Very Brexit sounding name, I'm not going to lie. Um, Ter Stegen in goal, Navas, Varane, <laughs> Kessie. He's got the <laughs> Oh no. He's got the Sioux Merchant up front. Alright, let's get into, let's get into the, the, the second game, lads. Mon, mon, mon the lads. Mon the Park G, son. No, I, I don't want it. I don't want it. I love that. Oh my god, lads. Tap it into the lads, honestly. That was like that was that was that was just that was just sexual that play. That was unbelievable. Put one in. Park G son at the front post. Park G son unlucky lad. Love that. Oh, it's good play as well. He's offside ref. He's off. He's off. He's off. He's off. He's offside ref. He's about a year offside. What the fuck's the linesman doing there? Open your fucking eyes, Stevie Wonder. Right? He's offside. Unlucky. I'll be tracking that rule. Gonna cut it back, guaranteed. Gonna cut it back. Watch for the cut back. Watch for the cut back or the cut across. Ah, oh, you don't, don't do it, please, don't. He never sued. To be fair. Sorry. Half time, lads. Um, and yet again, I don't. I just that that half never happened. Um, that was shambolic. Into the second half, Park G Sun needs to get the finger out. I'm not gonna lie. Park G Sun. Good play. Go on, Park. Park. Oh, beautiful from Jesus. He's moved his keeper the absolute fucking virgin. Oh, sleeping. Good ball. Leon Bailey. Go on, Leon. Leon Bailey. Oh, what a finish, Leon Bailey. Park G's on assist. Might be one of the scrap scrappiest, shittiest goals. Mate, look at his trim. That is... That is, yeah. That's good ball. Park G's son's there. He's got Moisey Keane at the back post. Moisey Keane. Moisey Keane. Park G-Sun and Moisey Keen, the dynamic duo you never thought you needed in life. Love that. Sit down, back in the game. Moisey Keen, Park G-Sun, ass second assist in the game, third assist in the episode. Go on, lad. Go on, go on, son. Oh my god, what a ball. Please, no! Oh. <laughs> Fucking... To send us to Div 4. Oh my god, I want it back. Park G-Sun. Oh my god, what a ball. Park G-Sun. Near post! Oh, he done it! Oh, that. Fucking yes! The four here comes Moisey Keenan like he lay. Four assists for Park G Son. He moved his keeper because he's a fat little neek. Love that from you. Park G Son assist. 2 0 down the comeback of the century, lads. Well, lads, that is the end of the second game. Park G Son is mental three assists and a man of the match performance and he just just got us up to div four in the last minute with the last minute assist winner um this card is cracked it's striker at cam no matter where you play him this card is so good um three assists 80.3 rating in the game and man of the match let's get into the third game this guy's absolutely goaded my my korean king i don't know how the fuck knows let's get into the third game right lads my kfc love that Come on, let's see, let's see who this guy's got. De Gea, oh, 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 he's got, he's got Parchy son as well, and he's got Fek here. Bonjour, you fucking wanker. That's good to be fair. That's n oh my god. Oh. Many, because he's obviously he is the go. He's the best player in the game and everything. But where's where's Park? Where's, where's where the fuck's Park? Oh, there he is. He's big melon head. Parchy son. Parchy son. Oh my 
Oh, 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 oh. oh geez, son, take a bow, lad. You absolute sexy Korean man. I don't know the words, I'm just making random sounds. Shit. He's gonna get the Korea. Who the fuck? Who? Right, lads, it's first half. Uh, first half is not done of the third game. Um, not the best performance in the world, I'm not going to lie. Um, but apart from that, um, Park Ji-sun has been pretty much non-existent, apart from that absolute world they scored earlier on. Oh, fuck off. No way, man. Korea again. Who the fuck are you? Dickhead. It's a good ball, lad. Park ji Sun's through. Love that from you, Park. Go on, Park. Park ji Sun. Sometimes it may be good, sometimes it may be shit. Oh, piss off. Oh, what are you doing, man? What? Use your hands, Courtois. Back here, man. Fuck off. Can you please retire from football so I can stop coming against you on FIFA? Much love, prick. Cunt. Oh, go away. Got it back, I dare you. Yep. You stop. <laughs> <laughs> Disgusting. Should be a 10 match ban. Vieira! Score, please! <laughs> right, lads, so distract the fact that I got absolutely bum holied last game. We're going to watch this absolute sexy goal from Party Sun just to take my mind off things. Oh my god, that is. Oh. Love that. Well, lads, this is the last game of the episode. Party Sun has been an absolute wonder for you so far. This is the last game we're playing. Unai Simon, Telez, Valver... Oh, oh my, what the fuck? Like, right, cool, sound, into the game. It's just how we use it, man. That's what I'm saying. But there we go, man. Go on, Park. Oh, lads, oh my. Oh. He's so good, lads. He's so good, it's unbelievable. This guy's unreal, lads. Get him, get him on the, get another goal on the counter, lads. Get another goal on the counter. I'm interested to see what he's like in like a midfielder role. Oh god. Oh, piss off, man. No way. Ben Cheddar, you rat. Fuck off. Oh, I've read it as well. Please. Ah, oh, penalty no. Please no. Yes, yeah. Thank you. Right, park, man. I need you to get in the middle. Beautiful. That's better for new park. Oh, that's beautiful park. Have a dig. Beautiful finish. Park G Sun with the assist. Lads, Park G Sun is... I'd, I'd let him do many things to me. I'd let him do many things to me. I'm not going to lie. Oh! Ew! Dude! What the fuck? Every, every day, every week, man. That's what I'm saying. Sweaty today, sweaty tomorrow. Sweaty every day, man. Oh, go on, Park. Park! Ah, oh, okay. Fair enough. I, I respect it. I respect it. I think. Um, I've... I like quite I like quite weird superheroes, like different ones. Shit. Oh no way, man. I'm sorry, right? Who's that? Raheem Sterling? Nah, I'm not having this big man. No chance, lad. No, go away, man. Dickhead. Right, lads, that is the, the first half of this last game done. Uh, Park G Sun is my bum fiddle, I'm not gonna lie. That man is unreal. Uh, very hot. Five assists, four goals so far. Last half, he's gonna score two and the winner, I'm telling you. Won the boys, won the park. Shit. Oh, go away, Ben Yedder, you small little French baguette muncher. Ah, fuck off. Go on, Park. Park G, son! Uh, Moise Keane! What is happening? Oh, my God. You know, lads, I went into this game with like, high hopes, and I thought I was winning, I went 1-0 up, and now I'm just getting absolutely... I'm getting it up with a bum holy, and I'm, uh, I'm not having fun. Pappin, you're fucking... You're 75 years old, mate. How the fuck are you scoring that? Fuck me, man. Well done. Go on, Park. Run forward, lad. One, one last one last push. Moise Keane's there. Ref, send him off, man. What do you mean, no red card? Oh, lads, it's, it's, it's generally scammed. I was throwing goal there. Right, lads, unfortunately, in the last game of the episode, we did pick up another loss, but Park G's uh, scored another absolute worldy and got another assist, so not a bad overall game for him so far. 7.5 rating, but we got absolutely pappin'. Like, pappin' absolutely bummed me. Uh, but that's about it, lads. But let's get straight into the pros and cons of Park G's son right about now and his overall rating. Let's go. Okay, lads, so at the end of the four games we played, Park G's son got five assists and four goals overall for a cam. For someone who's got high, high work rates and gets up and down the pitch, that is phenomenal. Um, really involved in the play. Um, now, I'll go into his pros first. His pros were his dribbling. 
he felt quite fast in the ball. So his pros would be dribbling, pace, and his physical. His physical was really good. He managed to keep his own on the ball quite a lot. Um, his dribbling was fantastic. LB dribbling especially. He was able to sort of like to maneuver around players, skip around them. Very nicely done. Um, his pace was very nice. He felt very good going forward. He skipped past quite a lot of players. And his passing as well was surprisingly good. Um, so yeah, I'll, put, I'll put the passing on the, the, cons, uh, the pros as well. List, um, the pros list as well. Really good card overall. Now his cons... Um, the only thing bad I have to say about this card is his positioning. Now, because he has high, high work rates, he would get up and down the pitch quite a lot, and that would result in him not being there sometimes. So when I'd be on the counter attack of some sort, he just wouldn't be there at all because obviously he's, he's already he's tracking back to help defend of some sort. But that's the only real complaint I have about this card. But apart from that, this card is absolutely beautiful. Um, overall, I'd give this card for the for the card itself. I'd give him. For the card itself, I'd give him an 8.5 out of 10, which I think is he, he's fantastic. If you guys can afford him, I'd definitely get him. If for a price rating, I'd give him a 7.5 out of 10. I think 7.5 is fair. If you're looking for like a box-to-box -box midfielder, this guy is perfect in your team. Um, he cost me about 204k, as you can see on screen there. Um, but yeah, I'd give, I'd give him a 7.5 for price rating and um, yeah, an 8.5 in the overall player scale. Um, but yeah, man, that, that's going to be it for today's video, lads. I hopefully you did enjoy um, that'll be the end of the Part G Song player review. I um, really did enjoy using this card today. And if you guys have any more players you want me to use player, um, for player reviews in the future, please do let me know in the comments down below. And drop a like and then sub if you did enjoy today's video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good night, lads.